We're here in the Adobe folder to look at the form we created in a previous lesson, this computer apps registration form. So I'm going to right click and instead of opening this in Acrobat, I want to open it with my reader so I can see what the end user sees. And whenever you're making a form, that's always a good idea to take a look at that form in reader so you can see what the end user will see. If you have worked with PDF forms in the past, you've probably seen this message before up at the top. Please fill out the following form. You cannot save data typed into this form. Please print your completed form if you'd like a copy for your records. What you may not know is that you can allow Adobe Reader to save data typed into a form. So even if your end user doesn't have Acrobat and is only using Adobe Reader, you can allow them to save data on that free Adobe Reader. All you have to do is first enable their reader to do that. And you can do that from your form. We're back in the Adobe folder. This time I'm going to go to the same form, and this time I'm going to open it with Acrobat. So we're now going to enable this form so that the end user can save their data, even if they're only using the free Adobe Reader. So we'll go to the File menu. We're going to choose Save As, and we're going to save it as a Reader Extended PDF, and we're going to enable additional features. This verbiage appears. This allows the end user to save the form data, to comment and use markup tools, to sign an existing signature field, and to sign the document. We're going to click Save Now, and we're going to give it a different file name so as not to overwrite our previous form. So we're back in our Adobe folder. This is the latest version I saved, the reader enabled one. We'll right click, and this time we'll open it with our Adobe Reader. And look what it says at the top now. Please fill out the following form. You can save data typed into this form. And again, this is using the free Adobe Reader and not Acrobat. So that's a simple way to allow your end user to save data typed into a PDF form.